What's up everybody, Dragonman24 here welcoming you back to another episode of One Piece Burning Blood. As I mentioned in the last episode, there was a problem with a corrupted file, so I have to replay through Akainu's episode for you guys. But that's not a problem. It's going to be a little bit easier now because my characters are slightly leveled up. So the battles will be less daunting as they were in the first recording. But regardless, we're still going to have fun. We're going to play through this story together. And yeah, let's go ahead and get right into this. I forgot to read again. Amidst the fierce onslaught of the navy, Luffy still managed to rescue Ace, but Akainu's lethal attack rushes towards them. Ace gives up his life to protect Luffy. All Luffy can do is sit in shock after he sees his beloved brother die before him. Akainu wastes no time in attacking. So Ace is collapsed and Luffy's just absolutely distraught with grief. And then Marco steps in. So it's going to be Marco and Jinbei against us. I remember this being one of the more difficult battles that I had. Ooh, you saw that sidestep? That was... That was high level gameplay right there. Come on. Oh my god. Cut it out with that. Oh jeez. Come on. Come on, man. Stop. Can I turn around, please? Jesus Christ. Yeah, this was definitely one of the more difficult battles. There, take that. Unity assist! Ooh. No, 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 no. Come on, come on. Oh, jeez, I let go. Ah. Oh. Okay. Retry it. Retry it, retry it, retry it. Nope, 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 nope. I'm not gonna let him get the upper hand on me that early. There you go. Take these hits. There we go. Is this gonna pick up the KO? Yes it is. Alright, Jinbei, come on. Nope, 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 nope. Yes! Alright. That was a lot easier than the first time. First time I did that, it took me like... Four or five tries. Alright, moving on. Collapse of the Marine HQ. Akainu doggedly pursues Luffy. And then Whitebeard attacks. The fierce battle brings down the Marine HQ. I'm not sure if that's doggedly or doggedly. I don't know. Jinbei tries to rescue Luffy, who minds is shattered with grief by carrying him to the head of the bay. Akainu follows in just the justice in which he believes. However, behind Akainu stands Whitebeard filled with rage and beyond words. Collapse of the Marine HQ. Akainu-san! 
Wipeyard is pissed. Alright. Okay, good. We managed to dodge that first attack. Stand. Stand, Whitebeard. Come at me. Ooh, that was not it. That's not, that's not what I needed to do. My watch is over here bugging out. Alright, pretty easy KO. Even when I wasn't paying attention. Being leveled up is kind of broken. In the story mode, at least. At the climax of the Paramount War, the Blackbeard pirates appear and kill Whitebeard. Luffy escapes, however. I just realized that we're getting star ratings for this. The Great Pirate Whitebeard takes a finishing blow from the Blackbeard Pirates and breathes his last. The sudden appearance of Blackbeard only brings further confusion to the fray. But Akainu won't let up and continues to relentlessly chase after Luffy. Alright, two, two opponents again, Jinbei and Ivankov. Okay, Jinbei, you can... Ooh, okay, I got red. Stop it. Oh my god, I can't attack back. Chill. There we go. There we go. Stay down. Come on. I want to get this done on the first try. Let's not let's not lose to Ivankov. Got the KO. And now I'm going to go into Let's use our ultimate attack. Meteor volcano. Whoa! How did that happen? I got caught way off guard. But we still got the KO. That's fine. Jesus Christ, that was nerd. That was a... Uh... That was a surprise. Two level ups. Nice. And now for the final. Jinbei clutches on to the crazed Luffy and runs with all his might with Aki Inu in hot pursuit. One of Aki Inu's attack pierces Jinbei and hurts Luffy, but Jinbei does not, doesn't stop running. Aki Inu tries to land the finishing blow, but Ace's friends and companions manage to prevent it, honoring Ace's will.
Is this the time to be worrying about others? Alright, Crocodile and Marco. This could prove to be pretty challenging. Ooh. Okay. I just managed to jump out of the way of that. Can we not? Can we not? Oh, can we really not? Okay, good. The guard break helped us get an upper hand on him. Oh. We might lose before we even get to fight Marco. That's one down. Oh, it's not. Yes! Alright, let's power up a little bit. And use my ultimate while he can't move anywhere. He got the KO. I wasted my. I wasted my Logia ability. Okay, we got the first attack, so that's good. Let's charge up a Fire Blast. Okay, we're not doing too bad this time. Okay, they switched. Okay, Marco tried to get the upper hand on us. Didn't work out too well for him. Come on, come on, come on. Let me use my thing. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm trying. Oh my god, it's not working. It's not working. It's not working. Ah. Uh. Yep. This will prove to be a challenge. Well, at least you guys get to see me struggle the same way I did the first time around. Okay, we got an offset, not exactly what I was hoping for. Oh my god. Can we not? Ah, I've already taken a lot of damage. Ooh, 
I didn't even get to fight Marco that time. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. He got this. He got the first attack. Lovely. Okay. Nice, we're getting some good attacks off now. Good, that should be it. That's the KO, yes. Ooh, okay, hold on. Relax, relax, Marco, relax. Ooh, he's he's got timing on that. Oh my god, he's got such good timing with that. Oh, I'm so dead. Come on, yes, get a good attack off. Okay, good. We managed to get our ultimate off. God, I'm so low health. Okay, I thought he was going to block that for sure, but I'm okay with that too. Come on, come at me. No! Oh my god, we were so close, we were doing so well. Come on. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. We were doing so well. All he had to do was tap us though. He got the first attack off, and that first attack did so much damage, holy crap. Come on, there we go, good. Good, we got the kill. Got the guard break off. Good. Alright, we're getting some good attacks off. I need him in the air again. Get in the air. Now. Yes, got the KO. Alright, that is that. Whitebeard and Ace, they may be the two responsible for starting this conflict, but even their deaths would not put an end to it. Blackbeard fights to destroy Marine Ford, and Sengoku fights to protect it. Akainu fights to kill Luffy, and the Whitebeard pirates fight to keep him alive. Regardless of the growing casualties, the Navy continues to fight. They will kill all the pirates till the very last one. Just then, a single Marine comes forth. Oi! 
Yes! I don't remember this kid's name. The Great Battle of Marine Ford finally comes to an end thanks to the overwhelming power of red haired shanks. The Navy claimed the lives of not only the great captain of the Whitebeard Pirates, but also the son of Gold Roger. The Navy has achieved an incredible victory. However, the sudden change to the balance of power in the world will bring about a new era of instability. The, era once, the area once under the control of the Whitebeard is now ravaged by pirates. Sengoku leaves his post and Akainu takes his place. The Navy HQ, led by Akainu, becomes an even stronger military force to stand in the way of pirates everywhere. Alright, Akainu gains another level. A whole bunch of people just gained a level. The entire Straw Hat crew, basically. Alright, but anyways, that's going to be the end of the Akainu chapter. If you guys enjoyed, please be sure to leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe to my channel, and I will talk to you guys next time. Goodbye.